Governor Mike Parson wants a report on how to make Missouri schools safer. Michael Mahoney has more on what's behind the governor's school safety task force. No one can just walk into a school anymore. Do you have your driver's license on? Sure. A security guard at Winnetonka High asking for our ID this afternoon. It's a given in most modern schools where students and staff are trained regularly for emergencies. They learn all the facets, how and why they occur, and the best ways uh, to, uh, to respond in the event of a treater at the school. The task force Governor Parson signed into law today will look at things beyond school shootings because school threats can include fights, bullying, even storms and tornadoes. And that's why Winnetonka's command center links to dozens of cameras on and off campus. If we have an issue at, at one of our high schools or any of our elementary or middle schools, he's able to pull up their cameras. When a talk of students go to assemblies on school threats and they have drills. We actually tie the tables to the doors and we go through the actual training and we have deputies knocking on the doors and it's like really real life. Safety Director McLeaves thinks this statewide school safety task force has been needed for a while. The goal to see what Missouri schools do right and how they can learn more about the best practices of school safety. As Governor Mike Parson starts a statewide task force on school safety. Michael Mahoney, KMBC 9 News. Now this school safety task force is going to work quickly. Parson wants a report by the end of July.